Hey guys, what's good? I hope it is going on well because mine is sure to. Yes, guys, I'm back with another video. <laughs> Yeah, so those who haven't subscribed yet, kindly, kindly, kindly just go down there below the, descri the description box and subscribe, guys. Let's keep on growing our family. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, guys. So today I'm going to be talking about high school insecurities. Yeah, guys. High school insecurities what are insecurities uh insecurities are anything uh, that you're not sure about about yourself yeah those are insecurities yeah guys and uh so <laughs> um not everyone is insecure that's one thing not everyone is insecure uh we have these people who put who tend to portray this um courage or confidence in them and they seem like yeah they're so sure about themselves <laughs> i'm that person too <laughs> yeah but way back in high school i was so insecure about many things yes i didn't show people that i was insecure but i was just so 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 insecure about many things and i and i just been like um tell people of what i was so much insecure of yeah guys the first thing that i was insecure of was my boobs this okay i used to know like i have such a big boobs than my body and that is what i used to know imagine throughout my high school life i used to know that and wearing my i used to wear bras not boob tops i just imagine there were people in high school still wearing boob tops so i would just see them and be like oh my god I'm here with bra, a bra cap size. Um, uh, <laughs> funny thing, I never used to know my cap size, but they were large. I think that that, that um also um changed to me not having um me not knowing uh, that I had small boobs or yeah the size of my boobs. But most of the times I was like um my, my boobs are so big they're bigger than my body and i'm like Arr. but now i'm like hey 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 you're mine you're mine you can do nothing about it you can say nothing about it or you can ah, yes <laughs> so um there was this time in high school and, like you see like people used to receive letters uh, from other different schools yeah and majorly us uh we didn't used to send letters to other different schools so it was only between us and mr boys yeah and uh so just imagine just imagine i received a this letter yes i, I used to receive other letters other letters if you don't know what a this letter is it's um a letter that is that is written to you to tell you negative things or to tell you mean things about you so me in this case i received a this letter that i had big boobs and uh, um the letter was like when it was addressed to me and from the start it was like um this person was really uh bitter about something that i did or which i don't know what i did and my you i don't even know that person up to date i don't even know that person the person was like um yeah he wrote some many many words like um i can't remember the exact words but what i can remember is at the bottom of the letter he drew he drew okay i can remember the name the name perfect well but i'm not gonna spill the name yeah i'm not gonna spill the name um and then he drew um some some girl some lady with some big boobs and uh yeah as in it was so demeaning mm -hmm. it was so so bad for me i was like ouch 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 but now coming to think of it i think that 
it was a prank or something of that sort because I never got to know that person because when someone disses you or when someone talks bad about you it's because um they know you and you did something about to them or something of that sort but me I never I never I never did something wrong to them but them they saw like I did something wrong to them and they wrote me a this letter but no uh, as i said now that i'm coming to think of it i think it's a this letter the this letter was just written by my classmates some and with classmates yeah now that i'm coming to think of it i'm thinking about that because um you know the letter was like uh i think there was no function that day but i received a letter and then the letter was like um passed from back actually i can remember the name of the girl who came in and, and, and said she's passed the letter i think probably it's her she's not a classmate she was a schoolmate yeah she came and i was passed for the letter and i took her you know the letter comes and then you're like hey who's this who's remembered me and i'm like mm, let me wait and see and then i go take the paper and read and see and i'm like oh my god Oh my god it's a this letter it's a this letter and my cue it has passed through so many people's hands to get to your hand so imagine the way people were talking not that i cared by the way after that moment i didn't care i just read the letter finished it um folded it and continued with my whatever i was doing i was i think i was reading i was studying or whatever it was perhaps then it was night perhaps and i was like mm whatever she was just reading about it oh what am i going to do oh what am i going to do what was i going to do nothing nothing yeah, the struggle <laughs> the struggle <laughs> yeah i was to you lakini sai na waambia mulisikia wapi mulisikia wapi mulisikia wapi ni kona budi kubwa you know like like right now i'm here i'm like People, so many people are going to get their boobs injected. They're going to get surgery. Um, yeah, as in, in addition of the masses of their boobs or whatever. But I was here so bitter. I mean about me having big boobs. Well, I had the smallest, cutest, and juicy boobs. Hmm. You body shamers. Shame on you. Shame on you. So another thing that I've been so not that it bothered me uh but I've been so insecure about my lips let me go so that you guys can see imagine those cute lips most of the times that people were like um you know what you got big lips you got fish lips you got big lips and I'm like they're small lips, they're fish lips, they're cute lips, and I'm like, oh. it's okay, I don't mind. So for the most of the time in high school, I was like, oh, I never used to mind, but <laughs> I'm this type of person who usually doesn't mind about my appearance. Um, I just tend to look good because I believe there's class in simple because. Um, yes, you can do your makeup, you can do everything and everything and everything and everything, but you'll still not look good, look good as I do. So I love my natural self so much. <laughs> Lies. <laughs> Lies. <laughs> of course, I like makeup. <laughs> yeah, I like makeup. So, <laughs> uh, so most of the times I was like, wow. This person has told me I have fish lips, but there's nothing I can do about them. God bless me with these cute lips and their mind. And it's and it's in my jeans. There's nothing I can do about it. So, um, and you see, like this right time, Kina Kylie Jenner go out to get uh, to go out to get their masses of their lips increased. And I was here complaining that I have big lips, as in someone out there would die to get my, my lips and i'm here complaining about them to shade <laughs> right guys but anyway um 
I got over those insecurities because right now I'm just like um talk whatever you're gonna talk say whatever you're gonna say you know most of these people who tell you mean, mean things about you they're just bitter and mean about themselves and they just tend to tell you that so that they can feel like uh you know i've poked your ego a little bit i've poked your confidence a little bit so that they can get to feel something good about themselves they can get to be like um yeah you know she's not perfect as she seems as she makes herself you see but wait what <laughs> you like you know we are perfect and Kwanza, th those things that you tell that person like me right now no one can really tell me that uh you know you have big boobs or you have this or you have this or you have that because uh, i've studied my body i know my body i know you're going to tell me this okay i'll just i'll just respond like that I'm, i'll add your comments you see you told me this i'll add to that other person's comment i'll be like to lien you can you money water because i you know said you have to come my group uh, no chills now <laughs> yeah guys so that's basically it for today's video and those who body shame people or tell them mean things about anything about anything about anything shame 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 on you now i leo 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 because that's really rude that's really mean to to to, to do that to someone a being that was created by God, a being that exists in this universe with you. So that's just so mean. And please, 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 if you're that type of person, um, please. So, guys, uh, don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe.